Okay, we're in Bodega Bay, the site of the filming of the birds. Here's a little shot of the building. They have the movie playing in here, but right now it's uh, like clips of the filming. And sometimes they show the movie in here. And over here we have Tippy Hedgen inside. Thoroughly enjoying this. Okay. Uh, we may have a few more scenes for you, but not yet. There's Alfred Hitchcock on, on the scene. Whoop. Tippy Hedren and Alfred Hitchcock. Okay. So this thing changes. Before it had the movie, which was nice. Okay, so uh, this is the Tides Restaurant. Alright, there's also these other birds that are hanging around. I don't know if you saw them in the other video, but we'll give you a good close-up. They're also gathering up there on top of the sign. Okay, so watch out. Okay, this is the dock <clears throat> on Bodega Bay. I don't know if this was used in the movie, but it is a dock. And it looks similar for sure. And then this is the bay. And there, of course, is the sunset. Just to the left of the sunset. Uh, over here, I think, is where the house was. The Brenner house for the movie. Bodega Bay. Good night from Bodega Bay, September 28, 2021. See, See what? The bird just swooped down on your head. No, I didn't. Your head. Are you kidding me? Is that just? I'm not kidding. It was a bluebird. <laughs> it went. Phew. Yeah, there's something spooky around here. There is the tides over there. Yeah. So we're going to try to find the street where the kids where the kids ran down as they were being attacked by the birds. Super fun. Now out there are those stark hills uh, that Hitchcock was looking for. He didn't want a very, very uh, scenic area really. He wanted a kind of desolate looking area for the movie, so that's the way I understand it. It's one reason he selected this place. Because those hills really have no spectacular beauty about them. And again, I think the house, um, I believe the Brenner house is here. Okay, well, there's really nothing to see here, but this is the street, Taylor Street, uh, where Hitchcock chose to film the scene of the children running down the street from the school into the town. So you are there. Well, this is the schoolhouse used in the birds. It's now privately owned. Um, but this was the original building used in the movie. It says Hitchcock was here in 60, 1962 filming. So the movie came out, I believe, in 63. And it's kind of neat. Still in great shape. Still looks the same. I guess they decided to preserve it like that. And right behind it here is St. Teresa of Avila Church which I believe you see in one of the scenes in the movie in the background. This sign tells you about the Potter School. 
1873, and then it was condemned in 1961 and sold at auction. And then Hitchcock used it. And then in 66, a family bought it and they restored it. And it's still owned by the same family, the Taylor family. Private property now. So it's kind of fun to be at this spot. Very, very well preserved. And the family seems pretty good about it because lots of people come here to visit. The uh, little playground with the climbing bars that the uh, birds landed on as Tippy Hedron was sitting on the bench is not here. I don't know if it ever was really here. And the teacher, Suzanne Pochette, uh, her house, I understood, was really just built for the movie, just the front of the house, and I don't think that really exists. Well, the Potter Schoolhouse from the birds.